Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the Inner Realms. And uh, we don't need cake on our plate today, but we've got something else on our plate. Do you see it? Do you see it? Yeah, yeah. We got Elytra. Oh my goodness, I've got so much to show you this episode, including, I uh, see there's a lot going on in that dome behind me, isn't there? But first, we need to get these wings on and head over to see Troge. Peekaboo. <laughs> did I, you did I scare you? Ah, a little bit. Hang on. I just got, need to go change my underpants. <laughs> oh, Hello. hey. Hey, how you doing? Can I just say, can I just say that that is a glorious mushroom? Thank you. Thank you. I um, It's not a 100% original, but it's original enough to me to say, Thank you. A <laughs> little bit more to go. Got to do detailing and lighting and the ambience, but uh, the, the High Moo is pleased. Yes, yes. I, 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 I've been intending to visit the High Moo. <laughs> Excellent, yeah. <laughs> he, he is accepting gifts at this stage. I think Jurassic's has left him something very interesting, so it'll be interesting to see what he does with that. Oh, okay. I will have to... I'll go check that out, but I hear you've got something over here. Oh, this is adorable. <laughs> this goes this goes right with your Wild West theme. Oh yes, hundred percent. You know, we're such a long oh. way away from the other end of the island here. So, you had to you, know, you had to trek in your wagon. On in. Yeah, I had to mosey on in with my wagon and uh, the wagon of wonders. <laughs> oh, it's beautiful. Can I can I peek? Well, you can peek. You can in fact you can go right on in. Take what you need, leave what you can. Okay. So we're not operating on uh, on a diamond economy here. Okay, you've got no, light. No, I'm, I'm happy to trade and help people with what they need, and if they would like to leave something in return, well, that's entirely up to them. Oh, that's excellent. That I, I like that. I like that policy. Uh, so you've got you've got honeycomb. So that's excellent for the new candles. You've got these, which um, um, does that? Oh, there it goes. <laughs> why, <laughs> why is this opening? Click 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 click. Try try another one. Technical difficulties here. Click 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 click. What are you doing? Click click click. I don't know what I'm doing. And it's not showing me. It's not showing me what's in there. Okay, you know what I have to. You have to do. I have to. I have to relog. Give me a second. Hey, I'm back. Welcome back. Let's see what works. It. What? What is? What is? What's? Okay, hold on. There's a chest over here. Can I open chests? <laughs> I can open chests fine. Your this is your shulker boxes are cursed. Okay, can Maybe I open this barrel? Whisk. I can't open this barrel. <laughs> what? <laughs> it, what the? What? See, I opened it, but it didn't. It didn't show me anything. Maybe the wall west is having a complete breakdown. What because in the a world? I the can Wild open West. chests. The chest is fine. Look, I open the chest. Hang on, hang on. Okay, here. Hang on, hang on. This is this is. No. Okay, this I'm... is not right. Hang on. Ender chest. I can open that. Right. That's can quite the. <laughs> can I open that? Yes. It's a cursed chunk. I... Oh, you know what that is? This is spawn. Oh no! Because remember, oh. remember, we had to move it. We had to we had to move because because we couldn't open anything. Hang on, <laughs> hang on, <laughs> hang on. <laughs> and okay. I can't open this barrel. <laughs> okay, hang on. We haven't moved the spawn far enough away yet. Hang on. Oh, oh, I know what you're doing. Okay, okay, I got it. I'm not yeah, go, put, go go put it in the water. <laughs> so when we yeah. when when we die, we just you know show up in the die water. <laughs> All right, do they work now? Barrel works, yeah. and I'm, I suspect, yes, lichen. I, I'm liking the lichen. You liking the lichen? Uh, although I did just build a lichen farm, but I don't don't hold that against me. Uh, honeycomb, perfect. Okay. Nautilus shells is not back yet. <laughs> don't. It is one of those <laughs> nights. Like, <laughs> oh, I love it. You know what? There's really only. There's really only. Why do I have a nautilus shell? I, I, 
I promise. The frame. Oh, oh, okay. There it is. Yeah. Okay, back in the frame. Honestly, there's only one thing. There's really only only one thing I came for. This stuff. Can I just, can I just say this? This oh, unveiling of this look new this. trading caravan. Look at it. Flawless. Look at, Ooh, oh, flawless. Yes. Absolute, flawless yeah. Absolutely flawless. Without a doubt. Five stars. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going. I'm going on Google right now. Recommend it. Excellent. Yep. This though, this though, this, oh, this is beautiful. This is beautiful. is beautiful because I've been, I, I can't tell you how many wandering traders that I've killed, uh, that I've wandered into. Um, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And uh, they didn't, they didn't have the, 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 what is it they have? They have the small drip leaf. They have the small drip leaf and then you okay. bone meal it and you get the big one. And that's excellent. And we now have, we have something on the server where if I mix this uh, this guy right here, if I mix him with an allium, I believe, it is correct. We get the spore blossom that's only available in creative. Ooh, yeah. I and I have a spot just for the spore blossom. So you, you, my friend, I'm a, I'm taking two. I'm I'm taking I'm taking Go two on, two, and I'm gonna leave you. Here's what I'm gonna leave you. Because uh, I know you were working on redstone, so you can use that. Uh, I'm guessing you found geodes, but you can always, you know, use these. There we go. I'm leaving you that. Oh, my goodness. That's very generous of that, you, Shepard. Well, that's how valuable this is to me. Wow. Well, you're welcome here anytime. Okay. Well, I will. Uh, I'll be back. But until that time, hey, en enjoy your wagon. And so where where is spawn now? <laughs> oh, it, halfway to the ocean now. <laughs> halfway to the, okay, so down the hill. I'm thinking though we probably need a building that that so we don't accidentally build that spawn yeah. anymore. Yeah. The it, it needs like it needs to be an outhouse. Like you, you respawn if you die, you respawn in an outhouse. Well, it you would, did promise another toilet in this I, Did I really? <laughs> you did. I you was thinking the toilet guy. I was thinking it would fit your old west theme, but um yeah, maybe we can uh, maybe we yeah. can get get working on that. Okay, well, thanks. Bye. Right. Bye bye. And just like that, we've got the big drip leaf. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Do you wanna do you wanna plant it? We should plant it. Uh where should we plant it? We'll plant it right there. And when we bone meal it, it gets taller. Look, look, and we go up all the way here. And then uh, do I need shears or do I just go? Boom. Okay, you click it, they all die, but we got four more. Goes back in there. Uh, bone meal. And there it is. Oh, look at that. Now we've got drip leaf. But I have a whole bunch of drip leaf in my inventory. And somewhere over... There it is. Can I pick this up? Is that a thing? You can. Oh, look at that. So we picked up the allium. And where's our thingy? Let's see. I think it's this. And then this maybe? Oh, 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 do you see it? This puppy's not gonna be available till 118. But it's in 117 creative, and so we added it in. Oh, and we need to put it. We need to put it. I actually want to put it right here. Can I put it on a leaf? Oh, you can't put it on a leaf. Okay, so we have to put it up there on the ceiling, right in the middle. I have no blocks. Hold on, let me get some blocks. And there it is. Look at the particles. Look at the part. Oh, they're starting. Look at all of them. Okay, let's get down. Let's see how this changes the look of the dome we put that right in the center and so that should affect everywhere in here <gasps> it's magical it's magical it's a magical wonderland okay 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 it's it's it's, it's, a, little, it's a little too much it's just a garden it's a pretty cool garden but it's just a garden get out of my face speaking of the dome i oh, hi hi b
Speaking of the dome, I haven't uh, I haven't really shown you this place yet. Uh, I've been doing this in between episodes and have managed to get, I think, just about everything that uh, that you can uh, that you can bone meal. So we've got a pile of bone meal in here, and the idea is, if we need something, we can come in this dome and uh, bone meal it. Like you know, we need some glowberries. We just go boom like that. And we right click and look, we got glowberries. Can you eat these? Uh, I'm not hungry. Uh, let's see the lichen. Look at this. This is fascinating. See the, how the glow lichen uh, acts like, I don't know. Well, it acts like lichen, I guess. Uh, but it looks really cool when you put it on glass. It looks good from both sides. See, it's just, that's just a good, I like that look. I like that little detail. Keep that in mind when you're making buildings. Uh, a little of that on your windows. You know, looks like maybe in a dark corner of the house. Looks like uh, maybe somebody hasn't been cleaning their windows so well. Uh, we put some candles. Put some candles in here in the middle. And we've got, I mean, we've got everything. We got we got this stuff. And uh, yeah, I got, a, I got a confession to make. I, I, I got a confession to make. I went to the nether. Um... I got, uh, I, I, I got tired of boating over there because, uh, cause we did a lot. I, I, I did a lot over there and that's one of the things I need to show you. Um, okay. I'm getting, I'm getting distracted here. Back to the dome. So here in the dome, we can, um, break and bone meal just about anything that we need. In fact, uh, let's see. I think I'm putting this in here. Okay. And we will get... We will get what we need. We can get the glow berries. We can extend the lichen. Look, 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 look. We've got a place, got a place for our nether wart here. We can just come through and uh, you never need, you never need that much nether wart. But yeah, look at that. We can put it right back and it will grow up and everything we grow, we can toss in there for potion brewing later. We've got the drip leaf. We've got, check this out. We've got all of the two tall flowers, and if you if you don't know this yet, which I think everybody knows this, but uh, all the uh, all the bone mealing. What's going on here? There we go. See, got nine uh, nine peonies just for uh, just with a little bone meal. So we've got all of those that we can turn into dyes. Uh, all the different colors of dye are available to us now, and but isn't this cute? It made it like a little 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 gardening area where I've been potting some plants and of course this is this is adorable um, the way the azaleas fit into the pots and uh, we got some of this again um, I may have uh, gone to the nether so I was just collecting stuff in the nether and uh, uh, he came along yeah 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 fortunately I had this so I set that down and he ran away. Eeny, meeny, meeny. Only problem is you can't hold it. If you uh, if you hold it, they will still still attack you. Hey, buddy. See you later, buddy. And over here's our bee. Uh, he well he's he's in there. He's not he's not out right now. I think I think he's I think he's sleeping. But uh, Dracolus Dracolus was so nice as to come over and uh, left us a little beehive and our bee nest. And he's just been. He's been cooking up the honeycomb. We got a little system here where uh, he gets sheared every time the uh, honey, honey nest, honeycomb, honey beehive nest. I, there's just too many names. Also, there's a bee. Look at the bee. Good bee. Keep making that honey. Uh, unfortunately, there are not two bees in there. So at some point, if we want to expand this farm and fill this side of the dome, we'll have to go find ourselves some more hives or nests or whatever Mo Yang wants to call them. So I think that's, oh, I haven't shown you this one. This one's cool. This one's really cool. Uh, where's my shears? Okay. So if I put the bone meal there and I get my shears, I can, this is rooted dirt. Whenever you plant an azalea tree, uh, you get rooted dirt right below. So I grabbed a piece of rooted dirt and we can bone meal that, cut the roots, bone meal that, cut the roots, bone meal that, cut the roots. Just like that, and we've got almost a stack of hanging roots already, which are which are lovely. Um, they uh, they work really well. Um, let's put some there, and there. See, looks good. Uh, what else we got in here? 
Uh, we've got the nether wart, we've got the drip leaf, we've got the two tall standing flowers, we've got the honey coming in, we've got the vines. Oh, 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 I have to show you this. Uh, what do I have? I have 16 bone meal left. Yeah, that'll do. Over here, over here, see, we got, we got ferns. You know why we got ferns? Because right down here, we've built a fern farm. Oh wait, I need ferns. I need ferns for the fern farm. Uh, let's see, we'll take these nine. And what you do is you put the ferns in your offhand and the shears in this hand and you go like this and you cut them all down and then like this and you cut them all down and then you go like this and you go pick up the ones because you've run out of them and then you put that back in your offhand. Really, it's easier than this. There we go. Just like that. And we've got all the ferns that we could ever need. And so we will put these ferns into the fern chest. We will close up the trap door. And ladies and gentlemen, that's the dome. So I think it's time I take you over and show you what we've been doing over in the monolith. And to do that, we're going to follow our nice little pathway. Notice we've got some lovely little pathways going around the base now. And we can follow that right over here to our nether portal. And I'll show you my shortcut to the monolith. So, um, it's not much, but it's a path, and, uh, it goes right there. That's the monolith. That's our base. It's just that easy. And over here, if we follow this little path, this brings us all the way back here. Oh, wait, do I have, uh, do gum, the, uh, I don't have my ender chest on me, and I don't have any gold, so hopefully nothing shoots at us. Uh, but right over here, this is the spawn... <laughs> spawn. <laughs> uh, the spawn portal, the hub portal. And if you go up these stairs, it'll take you to a whole bunch of things like a gold farm that Miner built and a bunch of the people's bases. But let's head right on over to the monolith. And here we are. Um, so this is going to look familiar. Uh, yeah, see, it's still working. Still working. This is going to look familiar, although you'll notice these chests are gone. And the reason these chests are gone is because we've moved them all down here. Yep, it was getting to the point where we were getting enough inventory that we needed to set up a system to collect all of the stuff. And so uh, we've got rotten flesh. Um, that's a little low, but that's because I've been trading it. I'll show you that in a minute. Uh, we've got bones. I've been pulling bone meal from there. We've got, uh, what's that stuff called? Uh, gunpowder. We got gunpowder. I was able to make some rockets. Now, you know, rockets require paper as well as gunpowder. So, um, <clears throat> I got a little farm over here. Yeah, we, uh, we, I took down the manual, uh, sugarcane farm over at the base and we set up this little guy. It's not always 100% efficient, but, I mean, come on. Come on. I, I don't care if it's not 100% efficient. I do care about uh, decorating it though, so we're going to put that there. Um, yeah, so we got a little sugarcane farm over there making paper. We've got gunpowder right here. We can get those rockets going. Uh, we have all these arrows we will never need because we have infinity. Uh, we have, what's that? Yep, we got string. I told you. I told you I wanted string, and this farm is making it. And then we got this one. This one's cool. We get a whole bunch of little things. We get spider eyes. We get some redstone. I've already used a number of these old broken bows to make dispensers. Um, we get sticks. We get sticks from the witches that die. We can get some vegetables, you know, eat, eat, your, eat your veggies. But that's not all that's going on down here. Not only, not only do we have this mob farm that's working lovely, not only do we have... All of these things coming in in a sugarcane farm that's pumping it out. Ladies and gentlemen, we have all the books. We have all the books that we need. Take a look in my inventory. Take a look at this helmet, the goldfish bowl. Take a look at these pants, my moon jumpers. Take a look at these shoes, my gravity walkers. Take a look at this space saber or uh, this space silk or... This oh-so-fortunate pick, or maybe the space chopper, or the space shovel, or... Holy mackerel, look at that hoe! Hoes are strangely useful in the game now. I... I still don't get it. So we've got all these guys. And we've been, uh, we've been... 
curing him up. See, this is this is he's the guy I've been trading rotten flesh with. Uh, we've been uh, you know sending him all over here to Matt Damon. Matt, good to see you. And uh, he's been taking care of things. In fact, we moved we moved the breeder over here. Get up there. And I had to turn it off. I had to remove all the beds because um um yeah they were uh they were getting jiggy with it. They were they were they were having they they were making babies. Okay, making babies, lots of babies. Okay, so here's uh that's been you know it's a way to get rid of rotten flesh, make some emeralds. But you know the real way to make emeralds, the the real way. Do I have emeralds? Yes, I do. The real way to get, make emeralds is this guy, because he sells me bookshelves. And he'll sell me a bookshelf for one emerald. And then I just go over here and I chop them all up. Are you doing the math? We just bought 12 bookshelves for 12 emeralds. Now we have three times that amount. We have 36 books. And I come over to these guys and I sell the books for one emerald a book. I get a stupid amount of XP, and we turned 12 emeralds into 36 emeralds. We tripled our profit. So, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my XP emerald farm. Uh, all these guys have uh, all the books here. We'll just swing by. You can look at the books and see what we've got here. And that has enabled me to make this available to anybody on the server who wants to come over here and spend their emeralds. They can do that. And by the way, Slime farm? Yeah, it, it's it's working just just fine. So you're probably wondering if all that stuff's over here now, what's underneath our base back on the island? Well, let's go have a look. If we head down here, you will see that a few things have changed. Notice our breeder is gone, but I left the wheat because every time the wheat grows up, I come over and, you know, breed up my, uh, breed up my cattle. That's how I've been getting my food. And uh, over here, we've got our lovely carrot salesman who is providing all the carrots we need, just throwing them over here to our weaponsmith. And now we have these guys. Let's spend our 62 emeralds. Block of quartz. Block of quartz. Block of quartz. Just listen to that XP coming in. Block of quartz. And block of quartz, and and you're saying, Sean, why do you need all that quartz? And I'm saying, cause we gotta build a massive space station. Did you think? Did you really think the domes were all we were gonna build? Ladies and gentlemen, it's time to start working on the main building. It's time to get this space station rocking. So gentlemen, thank you all for your service because we're heading up. Well, guys, I think that is about going to do it for this episode. I cannot wait to get started on our space station, building our main base, our big base, the base that's going to carry us through the rest of the season. Exciting times. Wait, hold on. I just realized we haven't yet offered anything to the Great Moo. So I wonder how you get in here. Hmm. There's Troja's wagon. There's a door. Let's head down. Ow. It's... It's the High Moo. Oh, great and wonderful High Moo. I present to you... Ooh, I wonder what Jurassic's gave the High Moo. Let's peek. Wow. We're not going to fight the dragon till next episode. Hmm. Jurassic is who gifted us our elytra. What a great dinosaur he is. Um. What are we going to give him? Oh, I know. Oh, great and high moo, I leave you this offering of a stack of drip leaf and a solitary allium. May your spore blossoms abound. I leave you. Like and subscribe.